watching the situation at Marjorie Stoneman Douglas High School in Parkland, Florida. An active shooter that is still at large. There have been injuries. This hour, at least 17 people have been killed, students and adults. National school walkout has been scheduled by the Women's Marches Youth and Power Group for March 14. The organization is encouraging students, staff, administrators, and parents to walk out of the school at 10 o'clock for 17 minutes, one for each person killed in the Florida school shooting in February. Um, so I walked out on March 14th at 10 o'clock in the morning um, and I stood out there for all the victims um, and all the people who tragically lost their lives at, during the Stoneman Douglas shooting in Parkland. Um, 17 minutes for 17 victims um, and it was very, very powerful to stand out there arm in arm with my fellow students and everybody who thought that this was a um, a very pressing matter that we needed to be out there um, and we stood out there and we paid our respects. I think it was important to um, participate in the walkout to just show some solidarity, um, the importance of giving students their voices. It was a privilege for me to be with students who kind of organized and orchestrated this. Um, I think it's important to feel safe and I think it's important to memorialize students and faculty and staff who lost their lives in a tragic unnecessary event so um, I was happy to take part in it. I walked out to pray for the 17 victims that lost their lives. I didn't go out there to get political or do anything about gun control. I just wanted to say a prayer for those that lost their lives and their families. Um, for the walkout I felt it was a really good collective idea to get together and show that the school is against gun violence. Um, I did support it so that um, people could realize that the schools um, and the students are unanimously against um, the current gun laws and uh, I think they should be stricter. So student voice has always been a big thing of mine so when the students uh, wanted to do their march and their walkout uh, I was fully supporting them. Uh, their voice matters and them having a voice in our country and our community is really important to me. So I was not going to be one of those principals who scared kids or threatened them with not with punishment for walking out of school. As long as it was organized and safe, that's what I wanted. 